Well, back to school time can be a nervous time for some students. Yeah, so on the first day of classes in the Jefferson County School District, staff came together to help students relax a bit. Joel Hill and live tonight at Dutch Creek Elementary. And Joel, this certainly sounds intriguing. Different schools have different activities. Yeah, and we can all learn from each other, right? We know that familiar feeling, the little butterflies of the first day of school. It strikes both students and teachers. And two remarkable teachers here at Dutch Creek Elementary found a unique way to settle down those nerves. So we had to, like, go under and over the tables. Attached to a rope by a carabiner, second graders at Dutch Creek Elementary in Jefferson County weave their way through a small ropes course. Their goal is to get to the end and get their whole team successfully to the end. And it requires perseverance, patience, confidence. Courtney, who wants to be a teacher when she grows up, says she got to the end thanks to her classmates. Because Harper and um, Braxton helped me help people out and help other people. Braxton not only helped Courtney, but weaved his way through the course as well. Everyone's working hard, showing grit and persistence, and we're here to guide them and help them, but they're in charge of their learning as much as we are. Look how hard this is. This is not easy, is it? A lesson in independent learning and working together. They're learning how to collaborate. They're learning how to do teamwork with each other and work together as a family. A new family they're just getting to know. They're fun and they're nice and they're cool. And on this, the first day of school, they reminded us just how important it is to put your best foot forward, especially when it's a unicorn. <laughs> Some pretty nice kicks there. Those teachers have been working together team teaching for many years now. They first started this back in 2005. And Dominic and Karen, they say all these years later, kids still remember their first day of school being attached by a carabiner to that rope. Live in Littleton, Joel Hillen, covering Colorado First. Yeah, I bet they do, Joel. Thank you. Well, we've been showing you all month how kids have been coming together for each other with school starting. It's those kids that will be the focus of Together with Karen Lee this Friday at 630. That's tomorrow. Every Friday, we showcase the good going on around our state. There's a lot of it, and we hope you'll join us.